trailer just popped up for it, The Exodus Believer, and this is apparently a direct sequel to the original. So we're just going to have a look at this, see what I what I think of it. I'm a massive fan of the original, uh, and I just want to see what it's like. This is done by David Gordon Green, who helmed the uh, Halloween reboot sequels, uh, and apparently this is part one of three, I think. Uh, so yeah, let's have a look. <laughs> Good day. Hey, be home by dinner. I love you. Good morning, Mr. Fielding. Good morning, Catherine. And here are your daughters, Angela and Catherine. It's about seven hours ago, and that's the last information we have. Catherine! Angela! If you can hear this, we love you. Please come home. Hey. Hey, you found her? We and Catherine doing out there in those woods. You were just walking and walking. It's not I remember. Angela, can you tell your dad how long you were gone? A few hours. Baby, you've been gone three days. What did you say? I know it's a tube of the bells there. I like, like that. I heard you say something. Hey, baby. You okay? Those girls went through, brought something back with them. The body and the blood of Jesus Christ. Yes, more than I'd like. I believe you can help get our girls back. Exorcism is a ritual. Every culture, every religion, they all use different methods. It's going to take all of them. Don't be scared. We've met before. First off, that trailer was quite long, and what I have seen in it didn't make me kind of go want to see more. Um, a, because I'm a fan of the original film. The original film, when I saw it for the first time, scared the bejesus out of me. And the other second for this is the fact that it's James Gordon Green who did the Halloween films. And the first parts of those, you know, were good. The second and third part weren't great. And the news that, that the pre-screenings for the, this film is they're awful, but not that good right at all. Um, the actress who played the mother in the first film, um, Ellen Bernstein, I think her name was, she has basically stated that she's just doing it for the check. So when you put all those together, um, and I don't know why I laughed at this scene. The body and the black. It's just. The body and the black. It just. just the body and the black. <laughs> it just. It's it, 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 it just overkill. Where the original film with the uh, Linda Blair yeah. who played that kid, it was almost oh. like it was well. creeping into her Is soul. There someone inside you. Sometimes. And it took over the innocent of a child. And that was the scariest part, and it ripped up a whole family of mother. You know, Ellen Bernstein was 
absolutely amazing. I just didn't feel that connection, even though she's in this one. And the fact that this is, this is the first part of a trilogy, if they're milking it. It looks like they're going to milk this like it did with Halloween. And I'm, I don't think this trailer, maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's another trailer will come out and it might pull me in, but three minutes is way too long for a trailer. It also looks very similar to other films out there like Evil Dead. I've watched Evil Dead Rise of the Night and you know, you got the Pope's Exorcist. They could have took in, I know it's the used tubular bells, which is great. They could have took that out. They could have took the mother from the original filming. They could have put maybe, I don't know, the possession on there. And would it be any different to any other film out there? No. The, the original Lexus was dark. It was horrific. Your daughter doesn't say she's a demon. She says she's the devil himself. It was scary. It's a bit where, you know, the priest enters and he's outside and the whole house is lit up with fog. It's creepy. It's just when the girl in that film, Linda Blair, when her voice changed into this deep, demonic essence. The Exorcist. That sent horrific nightmares into my dreams. This doesn't do it for me. And that's my reaction. It just looks like every other film. The fact it's George James Gordon Green doesn't give me any hope. So I hope you enjoyed my review today of trailer reaction, but what do you guys think? I, I'm being a bit too maybe harsh on it, but nah, it doesn't do it for me. But anyway, take care and look after yourself. Goodbye now.